CNN Headline News Update. Good afternoon, folks. This is Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 1 p.m. update. And we have a slightly mixed bag out there. That mix is coming from both the Dow, which is off 17 points, so basically flat, and the New York Stock Exchange down 35 cents. That is definitely flat. Otherwise, you got the S&P up 21 points, half a percent, one and a half percent for the NASDAQ 100. That's 178 points. Russell's up 1 percent or 17. Semis are up by nearly 2 percent. That's uh, 52 points. The upside, they're trading out at 28.55. You've got gold back 10 bucks right now, 1700 even Steven. Silver's off four pennies at 1867. Lights we crude down 20 pennies at 100.53. Natural gas up 46 pennies. Today uh, should complete the TD9 count top inside of natural gas. So that means, uh, and I don't know if today's the high or might have been a couple days ago. We'll take a look at that during the traders. That John, actually, actually, we'll look at it here uh, momentarily. Let's go take a look at our nine panel market update chart. And uh, to natural gas, so today is the, today, what you want to do is you want to mark the high of today, whatever that is. The uh, September contract is, uh, right now it's at $7.68, a price, uh, and I don't know if that's going to be the high of the day. If it is the high of the day and price closes above that tomorrow, that tells you about a very strong momentum move to the upside. In the case of the uh, ES Mini right now, it's trading just slightly above resistance. That's 39.50. A close above that suggests that we've got an A to B equals CD to the upside, 40.34 being the first price target. That's a likely outcome with the spot volatility below its 50-day exponential moving average. That was panel number two. Panel number three, there's already uh, the, the NQ has already made the 1 to 1.27. No, it's making the one to one A to B equals CD price projection level. And it's also trading up into the uh, center of its uh, daily profile, 12.517. Next stop to the upside is at the 12.837 area. The U.S. dollar index still has support at the uh, bottom of its daily profile. If we did get a close below 106.43, that would suggest a move to the 103 level. Gold right now is, uh, it still has a buy of the D point pattern, but if you get a close below 17.0450, that gets negated. So running into resistance at the bottom of its uh, bullish structured daily profile. That's normal. That's a counter trend move area where you'd find resistance. That would be at 1923. If price closed above that, that would tell us something different. Lights we crew consolidated with inside its daily profile. The price target being 102.22 and the 30 year treasury just consolidated sideways as well. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader Said Show. But if you're off to start your Wednesday, have a wonderful one and we'll look forward to seeing you again soon. Take care. Now.